Okay, so today I will be sharing with you a dress that I made and it is Vogue 8806. I made this dress out of a black linen fabric that I purchased from Joanne Fabrics. I made few B and some of the features. So this pattern has a lined bodice, a lined hood. There are front darts in the bodice. There, are also, there is also a dart in the hood which I had never seen before in a hood, so I thought that that was interesting. There is a center front zipper, and then there are splits on the side of the dress. So I do like that. This pattern is rated as very easy. Some of the changes that I made, I made the dress in all black instead of using contrasting colors. I thought that I would like that better. And I had to take off over three inches on the hem because it was just really, really long. Some of the things I wanted to mention about the pattern is that the hood is really wide. So if you decide to make it, that's just something to keep in mind. And as far as wearing it, I like that the front zipper could be unzipped. And if you wanted to, you can put something under it to kind of layer it if you didn't want to just have it with nothing under it. So yeah, that's just another option on how you can wear the garment or the dress. So I will show you what this dress looks like on. So that is my dress, which I really, really love. I'm very happy with the way that it turned out. Before I go, my love share. Something I learned about recently is goat yoga. Goat with the animal. What goat yoga is, it's yoga where yogis exercise and meditate in the presence of goats. Goats are free to roam around during class and they may even climb on the backs of yogis or run between their legs while they are doing certain poses. The yogis get to play with the goats, the goats get to play with the yogis, and apparently it's a very therapeutic experience. Wow, I never would have thought. So I thought that was so interesting. I wanted to make sure that I shared it with you. And I also found a video which I will link here somewhere. And if you're interested in seeing how it works, you can just click on the link and just see a little bit more about goat yoga and what it's about. So yes, I thought that was so interesting as I said. And that is it for this video. So I thank you so much for watching and I will be back in the next video. If you enjoyed this video, I would love to know you can click on the little thumb that's sticking up below.